Mark Levine, Excel Bradshaw Management Group. Now for today's quick tip, I really wanted to delve into minutes. Now minutes, they're very important both to condo and co-op boards because they're keeping track of all regular meetings, annual meetings, special meetings, but they're also used for other things that a lot of people don't think about. They can be used as discovery in lawsuits, uh, whether or not the, uh, the building is a plaintiff or a defendant, but they're also used by prospective purchasers and their legal counsel who are coming into our offices, reading the minutes, uh, to see if there's anything that the questionnaires that we are filling out on the buildings can't answer. And this will give them a good idea of what's been going on in the last two to three years, what's going on right now, and are there anything that they should know about in the future, and that could be in by way of work, maybe there's a, uh, a leak in their apartment, or maybe in their line that they don't know about, and, and minutes they think will tell them exactly what's going on, or maybe there's a big expenditure that's going to come down. Uh, so. My recommendation, and I've seen so many minutes that are like six pages long for an hour meeting, they're, uh, they're all over the place, they're including full conversations, is just keep motions in the minutes. And uh, there's other things obviously in the minutes they have to keep, you have to keep the time date in place, the attendees, who's not attending. Uh, but if you keep it strictly to motions and the vote for those motions, uh, it'll keep a real lean minute. So it'll also help you at the next meeting when you have to approve the minutes. Uh, because you'll be able to remember specifically what happened at the meeting. It, it will really streamline the process. And also, some boards choose to post the minutes, whether it's on their website or maybe it's by their mailboxes or they pass them under the doors. So if you have an already streamlined minutes, you don't have to redact any information. And it, it's enough to let everybody know what's going on in the building without all of the personal conversations that are going on. So I hope that quick tip is helpful. Uh, if you want to like us on Facebook, you can find us at facebook.com slash Bradshaw. If you want to follow us on Twitter, you can do so. We are at Bradshaw. And if you want to email me, I'm always happy to take questions and uh, give you great answers to them, I hope. Uh, mblevine at ebmg.com. Again, I am Mark Levine from Excel Bradshaw Management Group, and I hope to see you here again. Till next time.